In this video, we will provide an overview of pipe flanges and discuss the different types and faces. Pipe flanges are a component used with a gasket and bolts to create a connection in a piping system. There are different types of pipe flanges depending on the application and the strength required of the flange joint. The six most common types of flanges are weld neck, slip-on, socket weld, lap joint, threaded, and blind. Weld neck flanges have a long tapered hub that transfers stress from the flange to the pipe for reinforcement. These types of flanges are used in high pressure and high temperature applications and are commonly used for process piping. Slip-on flanges slide over the end of the pipe. The outer diameter of the pipe is matched with the flange and then welded in place. Slip-on flanges are suitable for low pressure and temperature applications. Socket weld flanges are easy to install. The pipe is placed into the flange and welded into place. These types of flanges are best suited for small pipe diameters used in low temperature and low pressure applications. Also called a floating flange, lap joint flanges are made up of a stub end, which is welded to the pipe, and a backing flange that moves freely over the pipe. Lap joint flanges allow for bolt hole alignment for easy installation. This type of flange is used where space is limited and frequent dismantling is required. Threaded flanges are also called screwed flanges. These flanges have threads inside that fit with the male threads on the pipe. No welding is required for this simple connection. Threaded flanges are not suitable for high temperature and pressure. They are typically used in air and water utility surfaces. A blind flange is essentially a blank disc used to close the ends of pipes or valves, or for flow pressure testing. Blind flanges have a high pressure capacity. They are easy to remove, providing easy access to a line, even after sealing. There are also different types of flange faces. The flange face, which is the mating surface of the flange, determines what gasket is needed. There are five types of flange faces, flat, raised, ring joint, male and female, and tongue and groove. Flat face flanges have a flat, even surface with a full face gasket in contact with most of the flange surface. Raised face flanges have a raised portion around the bore. The pressure temperature rating, called a flange class, determines the height of the raised face. An inside bore circle gasket is used with a raised face flange. Ring joint flanges are used in high pressure and high temperature applications. They feature a specifically designed groove for a metal gasket to maintain the seal. Male and female flanges are composed of two faces. The male flange face has a raised ring, and the female flange face has a matching depression. The gasket is retained on the female face of the flange. Tongue and groove flanges are similar to male and female flanges, but they have a different tongue inside diameter, and the groove does not extend into the flange base. Understanding the different flange types and faces is a great start to making the right connection. However, it is impossible to outline every possible detail and configuration. So Dixon is here to help with your specific application. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please contact us at dixonvalve.com. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel.